Hello everybody, this is a tutorial on Kitlin of Laoe. You will all be experts after visualizing this tutorial. Open a fill. I choose a classical music from Brahms. Do you like my background? Eureka! It's very simple to zoom in Laoe. Drag while pressing the shift button for horizontal zoom. You can even see the individual samples. For vertical zoom, use the command or control button. You can even combine both. Let's play music now. You will see, depending the last Focuset plugin, the functionality of the mouse change. Now we make a pause. For quick search, in larger clips, scratch with the mouse while pressing SHIFT. It's very simple, isn't it? Let's zoom to the beginning of the clip for performing a FAD IN. Listen to this part to have an idea of what to do. Ok, cut everything before the piano hit. For that, we select this part, keeping a small gap for fading after. Once it is cut, we can zoom in to this smaller gap. So now select the part to fad in. Perform a vertical zoom to have a better view. Otherwise, how could you believe? Okay, I think this is enough. And now perform the fade in. Well, we are done. So remove the selection, auto scale, and listen to the loop. It sounds much better. Doesn't it? Adjust a little bit the loop point. Now let's perform the fade out at the end of the clip. This is also not very difficult. Okay, we cut the last piano hit. For that, we select this part and cut it out. Now we can apply the fad out to the last piano hit. Select it and perform the fad out. It's very simple. Loop this part again to hear the result. So, then let's hear the results of our hard work. Oops, did you hear this cracking noise? problem is, we can hear it, but we cannot see it. And to solve this problem, we have to change the color. Ha ha ha! No, I joke. We have to switch to spectrogram view. We change the color for better optimization by choosing a bright signal and a dark background. Finally, switch to spectrogram view. This can take a little time. With this view, you can see the frequencies in function of time. This allows to see things we cannot see with the sample domain view. After zooming appropriately, loop again. Do you see the brighter spot above the piano hits? This is our cracking noise. So let's select this with the spectrogram selection tool. 
Oh, this was the wrong tool. We don't want a rectangle. We want the free shape tool. Okay, then select this part in one channel. Pressing the control key allows to duplicate to the other channel the same selection. Fine tune the selection in the lower part by expanding it. And once we are ready, we select the spectrogram filter for filter out our selection. Hmm, where it is? Okay. Mm, choose the FFT length of, uh, let's say, 512 for better resolution in time. Perform and wait for the result. This was very simple. Ooh, it gets darker. Remove the selection for a better view by clicking to the surface. Oui, it's very dark. Play the loop. Eureka! Like magic, the cracking noise has disappeared. And so, this tutorial is finished. Thanks for watching!